Hi, Froggy here. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to change your clutch master cylinder fluid using the turkey baster method, or it's sometimes also called the ranger method. Um, this is C506 Corvette, and right here we have the clutch master cylinder. I'm going to take this cover off suck out the fluid using some turkey baster or just this automotive syringe here then we're going to add some clean brake fluid uh, GM also sells some special clutch fluid but basically it's the same thing as the brake fluid so okay here we go put down a a cloth because you don't want to get brake fluid on your paint it'll bother your paint there's the cap a little rubber bladder in here this minimizes how much air is in the clutch master cylinder when you put it down there and you can see I think the fill line there's like a little there's a little dent in the inside circumference of the clutch master cylinder and that's what you fill it to. Now this is, all, this is clean and I'm going to show you how to do it anyway. Usually yours will be really dark. Just get the air out of the turkey baster. Suck it down. You can hear that sucking sound. Dispose of it. Always be responsible disposing of your fluids. You can take a paper towel and wipe that out. I'm doing this over again, so I've actually already wiped it out. And I'm putting the fresh fluid in. I like to put a little hole in the top of the fluid. I'll show you when I get it done. There. I like to put a little hole in the top. That helps me control the fluid. The rubber bladder goes back in. The cover goes back on. And this fluid will migrate or sort of circulate. It's not a true circulation, but it'll work its way down to the slave cylinder which operates your clutch and then it will come back up here so you'll actually eventually you'll replenish the fluid down to the clutch slave it may take a few times if you want to accelerate it you can get in the car now and pump this about 40 medium speed pumps then come back out and suck out the old fluid and put the new fluid in if you have really dirty fluid you might need to do this half a dozen times or so so get a get a big bottle of brake fluid this is pressed on it's good to 470 degrees F usually I, work, I use something with a higher uh, dry boiling point rating like 570 to 600 uh, but this stuff is not too bad Okay, now this is uh, just to show you the different colors. This is new fluid. This is the, the press down that I just put in. This is the color of some Ferrodo fluid that I used. Uh, didn't work out too well. This is some really dirty fluid. You don't want, you don't want that in your car. So that's how to change the clutch master cylinder fluid in your Corvette C5. Thanks.